Tonight, a story of friendship that evolved from a tragic tornado. Three years ago, Hendersonville volunteers helped families across the state border in East Tennessee who lost everything. News 13's Kimberly King has their united effort now to help others. Kim? Darcel, each of these three friends say it was God who brought them together. Natural disasters devastate lives, but there are many who see them and are compelled to act. People were just devastated. This was what the small Tennessee town, Camp Creek, looked like in April of 2011. It was where Marty and Brenda died. And the tornado just came and pounded them to death. He had a lot of roadblocks. Michelle Mace also lived there, and on News 13, she begged for help. In Hendersonville, strangers answered the call, including Sharon Lee Schuster and Becky Garrett. Now, three years later, Michelle is here in Hendersonville, helping Sharon and Becky tag items for the 13th annual yard sale for Carpenter's Hands Ministry, raising money for others. I had no idea it was going to bring me such close friendships and brought me closer to God. We have just become friends and family. We are bonded for life through a disaster. Ministry volunteers also went to Tennessee in 2011 to help rebuild lives both old and young. But the fulfillment of those who don't have a home, you can't explain that. It's why this fundraiser at the huge Western North Carolina Produce Center is so important. Last year, we raised $34,000. This year, we have a brand new hot tub that was donated to us. Starting bid, $500 for the auction. Hi. Volunteers like Jean Orr putting price tags on these unused pens in a felt box. The tags may not look like much, but each brings in a contribution to a heartfelt cause whose engine is the sum of those who care. Those organizing the sale this year say they don't have as many big ticket items as they've had in years past. If anyone is interested in helping find some of those large last minute items to donate, we have information on our homepage on how you can help. Just go to WLOS.com.